see the story of an immaculate conception and a virgin birth 4,100 years before the Mary and Jesus story. The pre-dynastic period, all the way up, the Africans had produced men like this, in Hotep, the multi-genius that designed the Step Pyramid of Saqqara, the first man to be a physician that even Hippocrates, the so-called father of medicine, is giving him credit and calling him the god of medicine. The Greeks changed his name from Inhotep to Escalapius. There he is. There he is. Wait a Homer himself said in the Odyssey what? That the god Zeus and Apollo, Europe's first gods, came from Ethiopia. Go read it. In, and I didn't write it. it he wrote it. Thales, from Thales down to Socrates. And Socrates down to Aristotle, which they call the pre-Socratian philosophers of the post-Socratian philosophers. Each and every one, including Plato, who spent 15 years in Egypt receiving their education. You're saying Plato was educated in Egypt? 15 years! See, what before you all had nothing right? of him. What every one of them. What you'd have me believe then also, it's for part of what you said last night, is that Pla Plato and these guys went back home and they were big guys. But they were taught in Egypt? Is that what you said? They said? came there they for the came there for their education. And they said it. They didn't hide it. They it's the modern writers, the modern instructors and professors who are trying to deny it. Let me get to something you said last night that's not going to make you very popular in this town and may not allow you to get safely out of town. You told an audience last night that you saw, I think, in a tomb in Egypt. Yeah. You saw it with your own two eyes, right? Yes. You told me that Moses, there were more than Ten Commandments, Moses just took 42. The negative great. confessions. Long, Moses isn't supposed to have been born until 1349 BC. The Africans were already in the 18th dynastic period. Akhenaten, who died before Moses was born, and uh, Enotep, who, who died more than 2,000 years before the birth of Moses, and others at the Grand Lodge of Mem, had 42 laws called now the negative confession, one for each gnome. They go like this, I have not killed man nor woman. I have not spoken ill of the gods. Moses is supposed to be born in Egypt, they said, at a place called Succoth. Already, um, it says that Moses get the Ten Commandments of Mount Sinai. It, Mount Sinai is still in Africa, right? The Sinai Peninsula is a part of Egypt. More so, is it possible for Moses to be born in Egypt, educated in Egypt? At age 85, he's still in Egypt and he did not learn the negative confessions? Is it possible for you to go to school, born in the United States, go to kindergarten, uh, uh, elementary, junior high school, high school, and college, and never heard of the United States Constitution? Then it would have been possible, impossible for Moses when everybody had to read the negative confession five times a day for Moses not to have seen those 42 laws and extracted 10 of, the, 10 of them, leave 32 more. Now, if you could, get, you could go to the temple of Setaiwan at Abydos, to go to the, the, the tomb of Ramesses VI at the Valley of the Kings, go to the temple of Edfu, where you would, by the way, see the story of an immaculate conception and a virgin birth 4,100 years before the Mary and Jesus story. But what you're trying to get me to believe is that Moses didn't get the Ten Commandments from Mount Sinai, but he got them from his fellow Africans. Moses was a high priest in Egypt, Egypt, a high priest of the Egyptians in Egypt. Then what was he teaching? He wasn't a high priest of the Jews. There were no Jews in those days, they called them. They were, remember now, there were no, no Israel yet. Israel is not until it, um, 1196. And when we to hear of Abraham, Avram as he was called, coming into Egypt, the, Egypt, the Africans are already in Egypt, already in the 14th dynastic period when he shows up. All of the pyramids are built. That's another thing. Everyone, the 62 pyramids in Egypt were built before the first Jew was born. Why was he fleeing from the Pharaoh? Let me ask what you was something. the charge? I, I could write something. anything when I want to write, you know. 